Hi everyone, I hope you're enjoying Science Saturday Biodiversity Blast. My name is Bree and I'm the Community Science Specialist here at the Pacific Grove Museum of Natural History. While the museum has been closed, I've been doing a lot of videos on bugs. Some bugs in particular are insects. Insects are in the phylum Arthropoda and the class Insecta. They are the largest and most diverse group of organisms on Earth. There's an estimated 10 quintillion individual insects on Earth. That's 10 with 18 zeros after it. Insects make up 75% of all animals on Earth, and they can live in nearly all habitats, on land, in water, in air, and on all continents, including Antarctica. So what's their secret to success? And why are insects so diverse? Insect abundance comes down to many things, that together make them some of the most adaptable and resilient creatures, beginning with their impressive ability to breed. Many species can produce hundreds of offspring within their lifetime. Most offspring will die, but more than enough will survive into adulthood to reproduce. Offspring also mature very rapidly, so the cycle of reproduction resumes quickly and can occur over and over again in a short time. Insects obtain the necessary adaptations to thrive in a range of environments across the planet due to their genetic diversity. With such vast numbers of different species, as well as the diversity within a species, this allows for insects to have a greater chance of long-term survival in any environment. Insect exoskeleton also works like body armor, protecting insects against the outside world and helping them cope with habitats that other creatures can't. Even their small size, which we might see as a disadvantage, is something they use for their benefit. Some insects survive by eating the roots, stems, leaves, seeds, pollen, and nectar of a specific plant. Mosquitoes and biting flies feed on blood, taking advantage of this unusual resource to ensure their survival. And a whole bunch of other insects have built a niche around feces. Flies lay their eggs there, and some beetles even build large balls out of animal dung which they eat and use as accommodation for their eggs. And then there's the insect's mighty power of metamorphosis. This trait not only transforms insects, but also helps them maximize the available resources in an ecosystem. Take butterflies in their larval caterpillar form. They chomp hungrily through leaves at a rapid rate to help them grow and spin a chrysalis. But when they emerge as butterflies, these insects feed only on flower nectar. Metamorphosis means the larvae and adults of one species will never compete for the same resource, so they successfully share an ecological niche without limiting their own success. This process is so efficient that an incredible 86% of insect species undergo complete metamorphosis. Remember, we are big and they are small, so it's easy to forget that these insects are moving in their millions all around us all the time but examine almost any patch of ground and you're sure to find them there. Their numbers are immense and their success is unmatched. We have to understand that insects are important because of their diversity, ecological role, and influence on agriculture, human health, and natural resources.